What's up, gang? Welcome back to the show. It's Speaker Slap with Beacon Lulu. The gang is back. Hey, guys, today we're getting on our channel as well, base, and we're doing a base video. Something that I really never thought I would say out loud. Like, a base video to me, it sort of sounds like. Way back in the day, people used to do these things called speed builds. Maybe it still exists, dude. I don't know. Where you made a YouTube video and all it was, was you building your base. With some, like, dubstep music in the background. Like, pew, 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 pew. I don't know. What does dubstep sound like? It doesn't matter, guys. That's not what we're doing today. We're doing something actually fun. I mean, I think. I'm gonna have fun. You guys might not, but look. Me and Lulu are gonna have fun. Guys, we're doing a base video today. We're gonna show you guys this base right here. This base that I sort of ripped off from somewhere. I don't know, I saw this base one time, copied it. I'm a pro at copying, and then I changed it around. And guys, that's the secret to making a good base. You copy something good and you mm, change it. I'm not gonna say make it better, because who knows? Who knows if you actually make it better? But guys, I mixed up a bunch of stuff on this, put my stupid walls on the outside, because you know, they're stupid in level one. And guys, I ended up with something that's pretty fun. I really enjoy having this base. I really enjoy uh, watching replays with it. And I want to share it with you guys today. And one of the coolest things that I've never even done yet is now you can straight up share your base. And we're going to share it with you guys today. We're going to put the link actually in... I wonder if I could put it in the title. Probably not. Uh, I'm going to put the link somewhere. It's going to be in the description, like right up at the top of the video description or in the title. If I can fit it in the title, that'd be kind of cool. I definitely want to see how many people try this out because I think I can actually count how many people click on the link. So it's on you guys. Let's get like a hundred people at least to try this out. That'd be so sick. So guys, we are going to show you the goofiest replays, the craziest stuff, the craziest one star fails or complete fails today that we can find in our defense log. And even if you guys aren't on 12, who cares? It's going to be fun right here, dude, right here. So this was a couple of days ago, a couple of days ago, but for, for whatever reason, back here is where all the good ones are. Look at this, dude. So, a couple of, couple of one stars. One star. Oh! That is it. Dude, I thought that one was actually... Crap, I thought we could still watch that. I guess... Oh, I think we just missed it by a couple hours, dude. Yeah, I think you can watch them up to three days. Cool, whatever. Alright, so guys, let's go up from the bottom here. We'll go to the lowest one we can get. The boss. What's good? Boss? How you doing? Let's check it out. So, this is an air attack, right? Yeah. Cool. I wouldn't... I can't really say whether, like, air attacks or ground attacks do better on this base. Actually, I think ground does. For whatever reason, I don't know why air attacks would struggle on this base, right? I don't see anything that would make it struggle. I guess my expos are pointed up. Is that it? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay, all my expos are pointed up. So, if you guys use this base, do the same thing, right? I feel like it's better to have them pointed up now anyways. Who cares? Like, what do you get if you point the expo down? You get a little bit more, but they don't shoot up. So think about like, you're getting more space overall if you point them up, because you're getting the ground and the air. Double, double, double. Uh, what is this? What just happened? I don't know. Um, <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. I feel like they just dropped the balloons first though. <laughs> Whatever. Uh, he's the boss, not me. So, um, it looks like, you know, one real good thing you're seeing here. Clearing the corners, dude. Funneling the troops. I feel stupid having to say this, but so many people attack me in Legend League and they don't clear the corners. They don't funnel their troops. And if you guys are a newer clasher, don't feel bad if you don't know what that means. Like, I don't think I knew what it meant for a good few years of playing Clash because I always just called it clearing the corners, but that's all it is. You do this, like, even if you drop your queen and you just, you know, she dies just to clear the corner, it's still worth it, dude. <laughs> just do it. Trust me. Trust your Clash dad and and Clash bunny. No, no. Quake noob, Clash bunny. Yeah, I'm not Clash dad anymore. I'm Quake noob. So anyway, guys, it's cool. Um, look, this is it. This is what you should be doing. And I'm kind of surprised that this is not gonna work because they cleared the corners really well. I guess the thing... Oh, they have six bats. That's the problem, dude. I don't think you should use tons of bats anymore, dude. It's People have really caught on to it, and you can't dump a bunch of bats on this base. There's too many things that are going to kill them. Also, look at that, man. That is just... That is an absolute meat grinder in there. Look at that thing. Look at that thing. Everyone's dead. Oh, my God. I'm feeling like some sort of savage murderer right now. I'm like, look at the killing. Ah, 
chill, baby, chill. You sound like a crazy person. But guys, in the end, you saw there, that was barely, barely a one star. Like, they barely got the town hall. And they do have a bunch of bats, but they're pointless. I mean, the bats aren't going to do anything, dude. They're going to get a couple more buildings, yes. But not that many. I don't know. They're actually doing pretty good here. I think the bats would go really well. Um, Over here. Yeah. Like, if you got that Wiz Tower taken out, this corner's really good to, to maybe drop the bats because we got Tesla's over here. <laughs> this person didn't even see him, but we got Tesla's, homie. They're all over there. So, anyway, guys, um, as I've said and will continue to say, if you use this base, switch it up. You know what I kind of hate about this base? The clan castle. It seems like it's too far back. I think I actually changed it since then, though. Uh, so, anyway, let's look at this one, guys. This is a ground one, right? Yeah, yeah. This is cool, man. I've done armies like this. In fact, this is kind of like what I do every time. Um, let's see what they do. Nice. Nice, I guess. Gonna clear some buildings over there. No, you're not. What is it? Hmm. Yeah, dude, this is back to that funneling, <laughs> funneling argument. You can't do this anymore, dude. You not. You can't do this anymore. You can do this if you clear the corners. And those two bats aren't going to clear the corners. But I guess let's see what happens, man. Let's let's see what's good. Uh, they just froze the town hall, but the town hall wasn't up yet. So maybe don't do that. Um, all right. Okay. They got it. But then they didn't hit the warden. So, okay. Look, this was not their fault. I mean, whatever. Uh, it was just a few things went wrong and it, and it killed all their troops at once. But I think... This sort of shows you if you go on this base and you go for the town hall, you're probably not going to do that well. For whatever reason, people do better when they go from the long side of this base. And that's risky too. Like, you'll probably get a two star if you go from this side and you do a perfect raid, but that's risky. You got a real long way to go. So that's why I think it's a good base, dude. It's, it's pretty simple to make a good base nowadays. You just got to make... You got to make a choice for the attacker. The attacker has to choose whether they're going to go for the easy town hall which usually is bad for them because they they oftentimes won't get a two-star like this or they go for the long game. They go from all the way from the other side and that's risky too because they might completely fail and never get the town hall. So yeah, make that choice. And um, only only the choicest noobs go from the side, which uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, okay, I shouldn't say that that's mean. In traditional Clash, it would actually make sense to go from the side because you can take out one of the Infernos real quick, but that's not the way the game is played anymore, dude. You've got to get the Eagle, and you've got to get a good path to the Town Hall, and I actually think, you know, going from this side is probably better, but either way, guys, let's go back and show you guys one more. Let's see what we can find. You know, I would like to look at a, a good raid, like a good person who had a good army and really just crushed us. What's that top one there? Yeah, that one's pretty good. Um, do you guys want to look at that? That's kind of interesting. It's kind of cool. What was in the clan castle? Frosty boy. All right, man. All right, cool. Let's look at that one because I do want to look at some good raids. I think it would be more fun if we saw one that was like a three star or close, but I don't think we have any. No. Nah. We ran double clone. Oh, man. Maybe we should look at that. Yeah, let's look at that, dude. That'll be fun. That'll be fun. I want to see that one too. Yeah, cool. All right, so... Props to anybody doing an army like this that's, you know, people use this army, but it's not super popular. I love to see stuff like that. Same with the bases. If you do something everyone's not doing, wait, you're just going to spam? What? I don't know. How? 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 How does this work? If I did this, I swear all my troops would go around the outside and do nothing. I wow 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 um okay so the balloons do all the way I I get it I've actually never done this attack so to me this was like <laughs> what are you doing I wow I think I would have rather had a couple free spells <laughs> like except for that second clone you know I, I don't think that one was necessary I think having three three freezes and not having that second clone would have been cool but uh storm my dude from Wisconsin. I got some friends from Wisconsin. Uh, shouts to War Noob. Well, it's good. So, um, 
Yeah, I think that's it, man. I think this was uh, just, a, just a spam that ended up being... Uh, I don't want to say lucky. <laughs> that's mean. Uh, but, you know, it was the strong spam. Strong spam. Strong spam. Anyway, that's it for today, dudes. Let us know how you're doing in the comments below. Leave two for Lou again. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.